New observations from the ALMA telescope have revealed unusually high levels of methanol in interstellar comet 3I Atlas, a molecule tied to early chemical processes that shape how organic compounds form in planetary systems. Because this comet originated beyond our solar system, the finding offers a rare chance to study the chemistry of a foreign environment and compare it with the comets we know. In this video, we will explore what scientists found, what makes this comet different, and what these results tell us about the chemical diversity of other star systems. Let's get started. The first clues that 3I Atlas was unusual appeared soon after astronomers began tracking it. Unlike most comets entering the inner solar system, it started releasing gas much earlier than expected, even at distances where sunlight is typically too weak to trigger significant activity. This early outgassing implied that the comet contains highly volatile materials or that its surface has remained unaltered for an exceptionally long time. Either way, it became clear that 3I Atlas was not behaving like the comets formed around our sun. Observations also showed a rapidly growing coma, the cloud of gas and dust surrounding the nucleus, suggesting a composition dominated by substances that sublimate easily. At the same time, the comet's reflected light appeared redder than that of most solar system comets, hinting at surface materials not typically found in our local population. These features made it a prime target for a detailed chemical study. A team led by Martin Cordner at NASA's Goddard Space Flight Center turned to the Atacama Large Millimeter slash Submillimeter Array, ALMA, one of the most powerful instruments available for identifying molecular signatures in space. ALMA's observations revealed strong emission from hydrogen cyanide, a molecule commonly present in comets but usually in modest quantities. In 3I Atlas, however, hydrogen cyanide production was unexpectedly high between 250 and 500 grams per second, indicating that the nucleus contains a significant reservoir of this material. But the more striking finding came from methanol. The comet is releasing roughly 40 kilograms of methanol per second, representing about 8% of its total vapor output. For comparison, typical solar system comets release methanol at around 2%. The difference is significant enough to place 3I Atlas in a separate chemical category. ALMA also revealed that the origins of these molecules differ. Hydrogen cyanide appears to come from deep inside the nucleus, which is consistent with behavior seen in other comets. Methanol, however, is released both from the nucleus and from particles within the coma, suggesting either layered ice structures or additional reactions occurring after materials leave the surface. Together, these observations confirmed that 3I Atlas has a chemical makeup distinct from that of comets formed around the Sun. Its activity patterns, volatile content, and molecular distribution all point to an origin in an environment with different formation conditions and material availability. The detection of abundant methanol is scientifically important for several reasons. Methanol is considered a foundational molecule in astrochemistry, one that can lead to more complex carbon-based compounds under the right conditions. While methanol itself is not evidence of biological processes, its presence in such high concentrations shows that the comet carries ingredients linked to early organic chemistry. One of the most informative aspects of the discovery is the contrasting behavior of methanol and hydrogen cyanide. The confinement of hydrogen cyanide to the nucleus suggests long-term preservation of the comet's internal composition. Methanol's broader distribution, however, indicates that the comet's ices are not uniform. This variation could reflect how materials accumulated in its original planetary disk, offering insights into the physical conditions where the comet formed. Another explanation involves mineral chemistry. Previous research proposed that comets containing iron or other metals could produce elevated methanol levels through reactions between melted water and iron-bearing minerals. If 3II Atlas is indeed metal-rich, the methanol abundance might reflect this internal composition. Such a scenario implies that the comet formed in a region where heavier elements were more common 
possibly closer to its parent star before being ejected into interstellar space. Thermal history also plays a role. The fact that 3i Atlas began outgassing at large distances suggests its ices have remained unchanged for an extremely long time. A comet that has drifted through interstellar space for hundreds of millions of years would avoid the heating and radiation-driven processing that modifies many solar system comets. As a result, it may retain a more ancient chemical record, offering a rare glimpse into early planetary environments outside our own. The data from 3i Atlas also help refine our understanding of interstellar objects more broadly. Comparisons with the two previous interstellar visitors, 1i slash Oumuamua and 2i slash Borisov, show that these objects can differ greatly in their compositions and behaviors. 3i Atlas stands out as the first interstellar comet with such a high methanol to water ratio and the first with clear evidence of methanol production in both the nucleus and coma. Each of these objects expands the range of known chemical environments, highlighting that comet formation is far from uniform across the galaxy. Overall, the discovery underscores that the chemical pathways leading to organic compounds are not restricted to our solar system. Instead, they may be a common feature of planetary systems with diverse materials and temperature histories. The findings from 3i Atlas carry several implications for astronomy, planetary science, and the search for chemical complexity beyond Earth. One of the most immediate is the confirmation that organic-rich environments can arise in many different star systems. Methanol's presence in such high concentrations suggests that the basic chemical steps toward complexity may be widespread, even if the resulting molecules follow different evolutionary paths in each system. The discovery also strengthens the idea that comets are valuable archives of early planetary conditions. In our own solar system, comets preserve remnants of the materials that existed when the Sun and planets formed. An interstellar comet like 3i Atlas offers the same kind of information, but from a completely different star system. Studying its composition allows scientists to compare the building blocks of other planetary systems with those of our own, revealing similarities, differences, and unexpected combinations. Going forward, the comet provides an opportunity for ongoing monitoring. As 3i Atlas approaches and then passes the Sun, researchers will track how its outgassing changes. If deeper layers contain different materials, shifts in the vapor composition could reveal more about its internal structure. This evolving profile may help determine whether the comet has stratified ices or a more uniform mixture of volatile compounds. On a broader scale, 3i Atlas adds momentum to the idea of developing missions specifically designed to intercept interstellar objects. With detection capabilities improving, more visitors from other star systems are expected to be identified. A dedicated mission could collect samples from such an object, allowing scientists to study unaltered materials from a distant planetary system in laboratory conditions, something that remote sensing alone cannot achieve. Finally, the comet challenges assumptions about the universality of solar system chemistry. If methanol-rich comets are common in other star systems, the distribution of organics throughout the galaxy may be far more diverse than previously thought. Each interstellar visitor provides new data points that help refine models of planetary formation and the chemical processes that shape evolving planetary disks. As observations continue, 3EI Atlas will remain an important case study for understanding the complexity and diversity of cometary chemistry beyond the Sun. Its unusual composition not only highlights the variety of environments where comets can form, but also expands the scientific framework for exploring organic chemistry on a galactic scale. 3i Atlas gives us a direct look at chemistry from another star system. Its methanol-rich makeup shows that complex organics can form far beyond our Sun. As we study it further, this comet may reshape how we understand interstellar materials. 